Dear Facebook, I love the way you have connected me with old friends from high school, and I love the way you have allowed my friends to keep me up to date with weekend activities. Ever since I signed up with you, I'm no longer a social misfit, but a prima donna in the world of drunken cottaging and the queen of underground karaoke party at the Bytown. But Facebook, there are a few issues that we need to resolve in order to maintain a healthy relationship. First of all, you allow friends from my high school that I've never spoken to to add me as their friend. I don't know them other than the fact that we apparently were in the same homeroom together in ninth grade before I got my braces off. It's creepy that they remember the overalls and the plaid raincoat I was wearing the first day of high school. Please do not allow these people to seek me out. Secondly, Facebook, you've now allowed not one but two ex-boyfriends to seek me out and attempt to add me as their friend. We are not friends, we broke up because one was banging groupies while touring with the other Spice Girls and the other was nailing his boss in the Royal Oaks beer room. These are not friends, these are men who cannot keep their dicks in their pants and I wish them nothing but the most degenerate venereal disease whores like that could come by. Facebook, I've also become addicted to you to the point where I display withdrawal symptoms. If I'm away from you longer than a couple hours at a time, if I'm working, I break into a cold sweat wondering who's added me, who's messaged me, what party invites I'm missing. If I go longer than a day without checking you, I almost seizure. You are worse than heroin. Facebook, you have also gotten me into trouble by allowing me to log on completely shit-faced to the point where I've spilled my pudding all over my laptop. As you already know, drunken Facebook is considerably worse than drunk dialing. I can deny calling people on purpose when I'm loaded. I cannot, however, deny writing a self-sabotaging message on people's walls and telling a booty call how much I enjoyed his throbbing cock last week on his commitment page. Please do not let me log in onto my account when I am this drunk. Clearly, I'm not thinking properly, and the Jaeger demon has possessed my body and mind. As well, Facebook, please stop with the fortune cookies, hugs, smileys, horoscopes, which family guy character are you, quizzes, and other insane bullshit that I must weep through every time I log on. Seriously, it's getting seriously annoying. You must make it stop. Now Facebook, I'm not trying to bring you down. I do love you. I just think we need to communicate with each other to remedy these particular issues, especially the drunk one. Sarah is still not talking to me. If we can set aside our differences, you'll see that we are a match made in virtual heaven. 